Hey now, honey, I've been driving around in my car Looking for some kind of open bar It's gonna be alright, gonna be alright Got no money, but I'll work it out with my charm Having a good time, ain't doing no harm It's gonna be alright, gonna be alright Hey now, honey, I've been driving around in my car Looking for some kind of open bar It's gonna be alright, gonna be alright Got no money, but I'll work it out with my charm Having a good time, ain't doing no harm It's gonna be alright, gonna be alright Hi it's Doodle here and welcome to another cleaning video. I'm hoping this video is going to give you lots of motivation um, to get up and tackle those jobs that you, you feel like you can't you can't do like say it's the washing up or um, the vacuuming or dusting anything like that. I'm hoping this cleaning video will give you lots of um, motivation. It was So fly, you got me like my my my. You got me like my my my. You got me like there's no other than you now, babe. Na na na, cause you got me like my my my. Like oh my god, don't let anyone. Cause you are shining way more than 
kitchen is getting so dirty and i constantly clean it um as you can see there's loads of washing up on the sides i i sort of neglected the washing up for a couple of days um sometimes i will keep on top of it and sometimes i will sort of let it sort of pile up a little bit um but i i think that's you know if that's the way it is it's the way it is i think nobody's perfect and i don't think you can go through life constantly you know worrying about if there's a, a few bowls on the side or if there's you know washing up to be done um but i think it's important to to keep it soaked and you know if you're not going to do it straight away to keep it soaked so it doesn't stick on like super glue and then you can't get it off when you go to finally wash up uh work's been busy it's been really busy at work and uh it's been full on in the time that i'm there it's been full on um but uh, I'm enjoying it and I do like cleaning. But sometimes you get home and you think, oh, I can't do any more. But once you get that motivation, it just spurs you on um, when you see the clean home. And I think um, another a big tip of mine is if you're struggling with, with keeping up with the cleaning, a really, really good tip is to declutter. To declutter and cut the mess back, cut the, the you know things you need to clean back things like that um, if you declutter it just makes it a lot easier and the space a lot quicker to clean I find anyway so that's just a little tip from me To be caught up in the middle like this But I'm gonna die exciting week um my new granddaughter has arrived um 
safe and sound so that's brilliant news and she is absolutely gorgeous um she's just so perfect i know i'm probably biased but she's absolutely gorgeous baby and she's quite quite a little um a big baby as well um she was just over nine i think it's nine pounds free i think she was which is fairly big for um first baby um so well i think so but yeah she's quite a very big baby she's gorgeous so when you first see them it's like a it's a shock how how lovely she 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 is and um yeah so that's some exciting news for this week no i don't really care i don't really care yeah it's boy it's none of your business if i'm a mad woman why i really love the shark duo um the handheld one uh the cordless because it's got these attachments so you can easily clean under the sofa i prefer to use a brush attachment because i try and get the dog hairs out because the dog hairs get everywhere so this will get any dog hairs crumbs dust anything it'll pull it right out of the sofa it's quite a powerful little um handheld vacuum um and being cordless it just makes it so much easier to to get around under the sofa cushions um it's something that I do periodically. I'd like to take the sofa cushions off and, and check that there's any crumbs or, you know, bits and pieces under here. I don't do it, you know, I don't make it like a ritual or anything. I, I don't mind if I don't do it, put it that way. So, yeah, I'll, I'll do this um, now and again just to keep it nice and clean under there. Sunsets, remember the colors They were wrong, it was way more than a dream We climbed up, yeah, over the hillside So right, we stood there all wide-eyed You and I, floating on air in my mind Cause there's no going back, no going back There's no going 
going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it tonight Riding on the dizzying heights
um, got a big shark out today because it's so good on this carpet for pulling out the dirt and everything. Um, I find it much better than the uh, the cordless because it's more powerful, but obviously it's heavier. So I use the cordless for the stairs and things like that, or just for the daily hoovering or vacuuming. And then when I need to really get a, do a deep clean, sort of under the sofa or the this rug or something like that then I will get out the big shark um, to use because it just really gets into the carpet fibers and really it really does a good job um, it's very hot it's quite hot when I filmed uh, this video as, as you can see I'm not going mad I'm not doing lunges or stretches <laughs> I'm actually sitting in front of the fan to cool my face off because it's so hot heat rises of course I'm in flat and now I'm not doing an impression of the Titanic there. I'm just being a prat. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'm doing, actually. I think the heat's going to my head. Um, as you can probably see, I'm quite a mad person. <laughs> I just like doing silly things, and I really don't care. And um, that's the different. That's the thing. I don't. I'm not bothered about looking silly. I'm not bothered about doing things. I don't know that others might perceive as being a bit bonkers. Because I, I just think in life you've got to be yourself. Don't try to be something you're not. This is just my opinion. Don't try to be, you know, act a certain way to please other people. Um, if you do something silly, don't think, oh, how's that going to come across? Because the thing is, you've got to be yourself. You've got to act the person you want to be. Because I th feel if you try and act like a fake person or a fake lifestyle then you're not being true to yourself. Um, and I've done some stupid, not stupid things, but I just, I don't know, I just, just, <laughs> maybe I think before I say things as well. I don't think before I say things, should I say. Um, I don't know. I can't explain it. I'm just a firm believer in being yourself. And, and if your personality is your personality, then you shouldn't change because as long as your intentions are good then I don't think it matters um, and if you're not intentionally trying to hurt others or intentionally doing it to cause you know anger to other people I think you've just got to be yourself and if that means sitting in front of a fan and or whatever it means in life then you should do it I know I'm waffling on now but that's another thing that I do I waffle on about stuff that I don't even understand myself sorry
I don't bother to iron any of my bedding because I can't be bothered <laughs> basically um I haven't I haven't got a love for ironing so I don't iron any of my covers I don't iron any of my clothes um well most of my clothes probably can see that I don't iron them but I don't iron because I don't like it and it's too hot so I but what I do what a tip that I do do is when I've washed all the bedding I like to put the pillows the sheet and the duvet I like to fold it up within each other so then you could just take it in one big unit um I don't know what I'm doing here I'm just like walking around not even knowing what day it is um yeah I like to put it all in one the duvet and all the pillowcases and everything inside so when you put it into the airing cupboard or whatever cupboard you use then you've got it all ready to go onto the bed instead of looking for the pillowcases separately and the sheets separately and everything I've got about three sets of duvet covers so when one's in the wash I've got a spare one or one's in the wash one's drying still got a spare one so yeah um, I keep sort of about three sets for that reason or one's in in the laundry and I need a spare set it's, it's always handy to have an extra um, set believe the amount of actual dirt that come out of the big shark today from doing the lounge and the hallway and this is after I'm vacuuming every day this much stuff come out of the vacuum I cannot believe it Show. 